Hi, my name is Claire Caroon, and I'm one of the authors of Operation Maths. Operation Maths is a pioneering maths program for junior infants to sixth class. Launched in 2016, it is still the most recent whole school maths program on the Irish market. Why consider Operation Maths? Operation Maths has a unique approach to problem solving, incorporating the use of specific visual structures that are introduced to the children in a progressive and developmental way. These structures enable the child to develop their own flexible strategies for attacking problems. Rather than teaching children just to do maths, Operation Maths teaches children to develop their understanding of maths in a flexible way so that the children can apply their knowledge to new or more complex concepts. Operation Maths promotes active learning and active participation by a number of different strategies including using a concrete pictorial abstract approach, incorporating the use of mini whiteboards to maximise on student participation. There is a strong emphasis on collaboration, the children working together, developing strategies together and constructing knowledge together. Throughout the pupil books and the teacher's resource manual, there is a strong emphasis on the use of discussion and maths talk to elicit children's knowledge and concepts and to encourage them to explain and justify their approaches. Operation Maths is also a fully integrated digital and print programme. The components of Operation Maths. At the junior end, for junior infants to second class, there is an at school book, an at home book, a pupil assessment booklet, a free mini whiteboard, and free 5 or 10 or 20 frames. At the senior end, for third to sixth class, there is a pupil's book, a discovery book, a pupil assessment booklet, a free mini whiteboard, and place value manipulatives. There is also a suite of TRBs providing a full suite of long term and short term plans, including plans for teachers in multi grade situations. Along with this, the teachers also have access to the full Operation Maths digital resources. Operation Maths definitely has you covered for planning. In the teacher's resource books at the junior end, there is fortnightly plans which are subdivided down into suggestions for both weeks. At the senior end, there are teaching suggestions for every lesson. There are also suggestions for activities and games. There are suggestions for math stations in the infants and first and second class books. And there are also suggestions given for further activities. As well as a whole suite of photocopyable resources for early finishers, reinforcement and problem solving. So what is different about Operation Maths? Well, problem solving is definitely different. Operation Maths is all about promoting deeper understanding and mathematical knowledge using a balance of playful, challenging and engaging activities. It promotes the development of problem-solving strategies using visual structures, a better appreciation of the value of maths across other disciplines, using cross-curricular themes and integration, including STEM. And it promotes an investigative approach to maths teaching. Let's look more closely at oral and mental maths. In the senior end, TRBs, there are suggestions given for oral and mental starters for every lesson. There is also suggestions for how to best use the mini whiteboards to increase participation. Throughout all the classes, there is a strong emphasis on the development of mental calculation strategies, including using doubles, near doubles and number bonds. Mini whiteboards are provided as a free and ancillary resource with books, 
Research has shown that the use of mini whiteboards in the classroom increases pupil participation and generates rich oral discussion and maths talk. Assessment for learning or formative assessment is an integral and dynamic part of the Operation Maths program. The free mini whiteboards that accompany the program enable every pupil to demonstrate their understanding and knowledge of the mathematical topic and provide the teacher with a rich source of assessment data. The books in the junior end use a smiley face system for the children to record their own self-assessment. Every chapter of the discovery book in the senior classes begins with a starting point activity where the children can communicate what they know already about the topic. At the end of each chapter there is a learning log where the children now record their new learning from this chapter as well as more open-ended questions. For example, in this chapter I learned about, I learned how to, I used these strategies to help me, I had some difficulties with. I am learning statements are used in every lesson to explicitly outline for both teachers and pupils the learning goals for that lesson. There are assessment booklets at each class level. Active learning and guided discovery. The key pedagogy underpinning Operation Maths is a CPA approach or a concrete pictorial abstract approach. This approach emphasizes the importance of the children interacting with concrete materials and using pictorial representations of the same. So much so that 5 frames, 10 frames and 20 frames are included with the books in the junior classes. Suggested materials are also listed in each of the topic plans, as are our suggestions for differentiation using math stations, pair work, etc. A variety of pictorial representations are used, including bar models, empty number lines, T charts, place value disks, and 100 dot grids. For children to value maths, they must be able to see it in their environment. In Operation Maths, the children's attention is constantly drawn to relevant applications of maths all around them. This includes connections to the seasons and weather around us. and to a variety of real-world scenarios with which the children can identify. There are also a suite of Maths Around Us videos as part of the free digital resources. Let's look more at the suite of digital resources. As I mentioned earlier, Operation Maths is a fully integrated print and digital package. Therefore, the easiest way for a teacher to access the digital resources is to click on the hyperlinks when viewing the digital book. Central to the Operation Maths digital resources is a suite of seven custom-made manipulatives. These include the sorting and shop e-manipulative, the place value e-manipulative, 100 square, bar modelling, counting stick, fractions, clock. Each of the manipulatives have numerous possibilities. For example, on the clock e-manipulative, you can view an analog clock or a digital clock, or both together. You can see the times at the same time, or you can hide the time words or reveal them. Similarly, on the 100th square e-manipulative, you can choose to view all the numbers on the square, none of the numbers, some of the numbers. You can have counters covering the numbers. You can click on the numbers to reveal the number underneath and you can click on the numbers to hide. These tools can be used in two different modes. They can be used in a create mode where a teacher can use them to suit their own needs or they can be used as ready to go activities where the workspace is already set up and the questions for the teacher are available to view on the left hand margin.
The digital resources also include Right Height Show videos and Maths Around Us videos, which are designed to be used in conjunction with the pupils' mini whiteboards. To link with coding, there are scratch-based lessons, as well as a suite of follow-on web links. So to recap, with the digital materials, you have seven key e-manipulatives that can be used both in ready-to-go mode or as create activities. You have two main sets of videos, the Maths Around Us videos and the Right Height Show videos, as well as having scratch activities and follow-on web links. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this presentation. If you'd like to find out more about the Operation Maths program, you can go to operationmaths.ie where you can view samples and find out more about all the components. You can also look up the operationmaths.ie blog to read lots of interesting articles about the various topics in the Maths program. If you'd like to get samples, you can contact any of the EDCO representatives in your area. Thank you.